An emissary led by Somali President Hassan Sheikh Mohamud arrived in Kampala, Uganda to conclude the training of Somali Armed Forces units that had completed their training in Uganda on Saturday night. President Hassan Sheikh Mohamud expressed his gratitude to the Uganda government for aiding the Somali forces amid the Al Shabaab menace. He emphasized the significance of reforming the armed forces, stating that they formed the foundation of the government and that they are very fundamental in hammering the enemy. Uganda's president has already pledged to support Somalia by training their armed forces and stressed the importance of reforming them. Museveni opines that Somalia's perennial security problem can be subsided by consolidating the Somali National Army, enabling it to assume responsibility from the Africa Union Transition Mission in Somalia. Uganda has been on a peacekeeping mission in Somalia since 2007. It has the largest contingent in the Africa Union Mission in Somalia, comprising of the Benadir, Middle and Lower Shabele regions. In a recent interview with the press, Hussein Sheikh Ali, the chief staff of the Somali National Army, stated that Somalia has sent 3,000 soldiers each to Eritrea and Uganda in the preceding few weeks, and an additional 6,000 recruits will be sent to Ethiopia and Egypt. The goal, he said, is to have 15,000 soldiers ready by the end of 2023. Somalia's defense minister said that the move was part of a larger strategy to increase the number of the trained soldiers to 15,000 within 2023.